everybody, I'm here with another video today and I have a special guest with me. This is Andrew, my fiance. Hi. <laughs> and we decided that we were going to do a video for you showing you guys what we got from each other for Christmas. So there's lots of good stuff in here and I hope you like the video. So um, let's get started. Do you want to show one first? Okay. Um, so uh, I... I'm secretly just a kid on the inside. So we made lists this year. Like we made lists and exchanged a few suggested items. Uh, but Tam got this one for me and I it was on list, but I'm very happy I got it. It is a, a WWE encyclopedia. And it's uh it's about this big and uh it's really awesome because it kinda outlines every wrestler like to ever wrestle in the WWE. Um uh, and it's it's pretty crazy because there's stuff in here that like like that spans the 60, the 50s, 60s, 70s, and, and 80s and stuff that I don't even know about. So it's really cool to go down memory lane and read up about um, other wrestlers. So I really love this encyclopedia. Andrew is one of the biggest wrestling fans in the world, <laughs> I think. Yeah, it's it's really awesome gift and like it's uh, it's super cool because like I it's not it's not something I normally buy for myself and I think that's like a really good gift. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'll show one. So, um, hmm, the first thing that I'll show you is this pair of earrings that I got, and they are Michael Kors earrings. Um, I'll just hold them, and if I realize that you can't see them really well in the video, I will put a picture in for you. So, they look just like that. They're kind of like gold um, padlocks, is that what they're called? Yeah. Is that like the shape of them? And then it's got like a, well, a diamond <laughs> in the middle and little um, diamonds on the top right there and they're so pretty and I've wanted them for a really long time so I was really happy to get those. That's great. Thanks. Uh, go ahead. Okay, so <laughs> Tam got me um, some, you know, some practical things. She got me a, a pack of underwear from H&M, uh, my size, it's organic cotton. <laughs> um, she also, she, she caught me looking at uh, some shirts at Express and they didn't have it in my in my size, in the color I wanted. So she snuck off one day and picked me up the shirt I wanted to get. And it's um, it's an Express shirt. Uh, I've worn Express shirts for, for years now. They're like the first shirts I got when I got an adult job. And um, what I really like about them is uh, there's a little bit of a stretch in them. And uh, they wear really, really well. They they dry clean really well. Uh, they're really affordable, and there's just a lot of colors. So it's one of those things where if one of them fits you, you can just get a whole bunch of different colors. Um, and what's great is uh, just recently this year, I I changed my fit of shirt. So um, you know, I Tam was able to get me new dress shirts, and she got me this one. I really love it. Yeah, they look so nice on him. Okay, my turn? Yeah. Okay, so the next thing that I got is another piece of jewelry, and it is from Tiffany's, and this is something that I really wanted for a long time too, and it's a silver Tiffany's bracelet, and it's just got the silver beads on it. Maybe you can see it better like that. And it's got a little charm on it that says, it's a little circle charm right here, and it says, I love you on it. And it's so beautiful, and it's nice to wear on its own, or you can just wear it with a watch or a couple of other bracelets, and it's so beautiful, so I'm really happy that I got that one. Okay. okay you go ahead. Um, okay. I had been dropping hints about this for a long time, and we went to a gift exchange, um, like like a week before Christmas, it was a Christmas party, and uh, someone had brought a, a pirate puppet in, and it was like a top gift and everyone was stealing it, and I had it for a bit, and it got stolen from me, uh, but Tam made up for it with this Ernie hand puppet, and uh, Ernie as a kid, um, let's see, Ernie as a kid, <laughs> Ernie and I have, have had a connection. Um, my first like toy ever was an Ernie um, stuffed animal, stuffed doll, and uh, it's one of those things I've always had. And whenever we go to my parents' house, it's still in my bedroom, and my mom still makes references to it. So this is really great, and uh, uh, I'm definitely going to use this um, around the house and on stage. And <laughs> Andrew's an improviser. I know. I don't think I've ever told you that. So he improvises. So that's what he means when he says on stage. <laughs> I'm really happy yeah. I got this. Ernie's like a like a comfort item for him. He is a, he is a comfort yeah. item for me. Uh, Tam also got me this really awesome. They pull out of the package. Uh, this really cool Ghostbusters tie clip. I don't know if you guys can see it, but um, it's a tie clip and it has the Ghostbusters logo there. And I love Ghostbusters. 
along with pro wrestling and and uh, back to the future back to the future and... uh, <laughs> but uh yeah i've been wearing tie clips uh more and more um so i had just made a comment that i wanted this and tam got it for me it's very cool okay the next thing that i got is another piece of jewelry this is um, also from Tiffany's. I feel like I had a lot of jewelry on my Christmas list this year because it's one of my favorite things. Um, but this is a pair of earrings and they're kind of like the, I think like the signature um, earrings. They are the heart shaped and it says please return to Tiffany's. Um, lots of people I know have them, just the little silver hearts, and they're so cute. They're so cute to wear if you don't feel like dressing up a lot, or if you do want to dress up, it's a nice accessory to have. Um, so I've been wearing these a lot since I've got them, and I'm really happy about them. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> uh, okay, so uh, two things I really want to show, and um, so aside from pro wrestling, Back to the Future, Ghostbusters. Uh, Star Trek. I love shoes. <laughs> love uh, shoes. Love shoes. Uh, I think I may be one of the few males where the male, the men's shoe collection is greater than the female I shoe think collection. So. Uh, so Tam got me two pairs of shoes. Um, the first pair. So after I'm done, uh, after I get all my shoes, I put them in these Tupperware containers. And I put them in my in my shoe area. Uh, just keeps it neat and organized. Uh, so the first one is uh, this pair of Air Max, uh, Air Max 90s. Um, I love this shoe. And the first, the, first, like the first big gift you got me was a pair of uh, Steve Nash Air Max 90s in 2000, uh, 2006. And uh, I just love the colorways. I love, they're so comfortable, they're so wearable. Um, they, they fit really well, they're super comfy. And uh, what I like about them is just they come in different colorways. Um, they come in just crazy different colors and it, it always surprises me on the new colors that come out. So um, I love this I love this dark red and orange colorway mix. Um, the only thing, the only downside to these shoes is these uh, these these like these sidewalls right here. Uh, sometimes they end up cracking. So uh, when I get them right away, I make sure I protect them, uh, clean them, take care of them. Um, and always put them in boxes. That's the first pair she got me. And uh, this next pair, I uh, I saw these in a store. I saw these in um, in Foot Locker a while ago, and I I started ruling. But I had set this no shoes rule, uh, no more new shoes. But even though he's really bad at following that rule, terrible at following <laughs> that rule. Uh, but I, I love I love this colorway. Uh, it has like the really nice uh, dark gray with the red. Um, the, the fabric is, it's like a, like a rubbery kind of sneaker material. I really like that. It's got like a really nice solid feel to it. Um, and like I said, they're super comfortable. The gray laces just do it really well. I love it because you can kind of match it with any outfit you're wearing. Um, the red is really subtle and, and the gray is a really clean and, and simple look to it. So I love these and I'll definitely be wearing them. They're very beautiful. Okay, the next thing that I got is something that I've also really wanted for a while, and you might think it's kind of a weird gift, but I was really happy about it. Um, I got this. Well, it comes in this box. I'll show you the box, the Swarovski box. And um, it's a Swarovski USB key, and it's pink, and it's sparkly, and I love it so, so much. And um, the reason why I asked for this is because with work I have to save all my stuff all the time so I'm going through lots of USBs and I'm, I decided oh I might as well just have one that I really love and is really beautiful and I'm so happy with it so it's going to make me um, excited to save all my work I guess. <laughs> yeah it's, it was really it was really fun picking it out. Um, it, there's a few different colors and I, I hope I got yeah, the right Yeah no color. I like this color a lot I like the pink. It's very girly and it's very sparkly and it's very me. <laughs> it's very, it's very town. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, so uh, this, as you can see, uh, Tam got me more gifts uh, because but we still spent. We the still same set, we had a, we had <laughs> set a price limit, and uh, we weren't gonna go over it. So, My gifts uh, were just more expensive. Yeah. Um, so. Uh, so you go ahead. Do you do you yeah. have something else? Hold on, let me grab it. Next thing Tam got me is uh, this right here. There's a the light's gonna. Ref ref shine off it like that but um this is the the air, nike air mags uh from back to the future 2 and the hoverboard and uh i was searching on etsy for this uh a while ago and uh i it, it showed up and i saw it was such an awesome 
art prints. Um, it has the um, the shoes, which are done perfectly. Um, it's limited edition, and the way it came was just amazing. And uh, uh, Tam and I on, on Boxing Day, we we went out and got a frame for this. So I really love it. It's, it's definitely gonna go into um, my my room which is the, the basement I've turned into kind of like my man room. But it's uh, awesome. It's actually... It's a really awesome it's room. It's really cool. Mm -hmm. um, but, uh, yeah, I really love it. And uh, I'm trying to convince Tam to let me hang it on the main floor. I might be losing that battle. But uh, I, 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 think, I think it's one of the ones I could win over time. Maybe it might sneak up on the main room floor. We're not sure. <laughs> We're not sure We're yet. We're not sure yet. But I really love it. I love... Just everything back to the future. This is just kind of cool. It combines two things I love, the like the, the hoverboard and the shoes. Um, so I'm really happy I got this. The colors are so nice on it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, the next thing that I got is one of two perfumes. So I'll show you this one first. It's the perfume from Express called Love Express. And it's one that I've wanted for a really long time. I've just never bought it for myself before. And every time I do go into Express, I always spray it all over me um, just because I love the smell so, so much. So Andrew was so nice and he got me this perfume. And I guess I'll just do the other one yeah, since yeah. Um, I'm talking about perfume. So the next one, it actually came in this box. It's Burberry. And I think I've told you before that Burberry is one of my favorite. Burberry Brit is one of my favorite perfumes ever. Um, I took the plastic that came inside of this out. Um, but it came with the big bottle of the perfume. So I was really happy about that. And it also came with a body lotion and with the body wash. So it was a really good set, and I hope it lasts me for a really long time, but I usually go through this perfume really, really fast, so I'll try to save it as best as I can. It's really nice. Yeah. I'm really happy I got that for you. Yeah, it's one of my favorite smells in the whole world. If you haven't tried this kind of perfume, you should go um, smell it, and I'm sure you will love it too. Yeah, I bought that at Sephora for you, mm -hmm. and I went in during the day. And uh, 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 like, a, like a single dude by himself in Sephora is like, like nonstop, can I help you, can I help you? And uh, three ladies ended up helping me that day and they helped me get that down. I was really happy about nice. that. Nice. Um, okay, so uh, this, is, this is one I have been asking for for a long time. And I, I'm always looking at it on Etsy and I'm always making comments on it. And so a um, little nerd talk for you. <laughs> uh, I've been for like the last eight months building a proton pack, which is the backpack, the gun from Ghostbusters 1 and 2. And uh, I've gotten all the right parts for it. I did research on like the movie ones and I joined uh, the GB fans community. And it's it's in the basement, been working on it. It's um, He's done a really, really, really amazing job at you. this project. Yeah. It's kind of like, it's like my art piece, my, my baby. Um, but uh, there's something else I was looking at and... Uh, Tam got it for me, and it is a, uh, I love it so much, it is a plush uh, proton pack. Um, <laughs> it's awesome. And, uh, you know, I saw pictures of it, and I just, I, I thought they were great, but like, getting it in person, you see all the details of it. Um, it's got so many things. Uh, it's got the, uh, the the ribbon cable, the, the, the cyclotron, the... Uh, the, uh, the booster tube, uh, the thrower on it is awesome. It's held together. It's, it's put on by Velcro. And, like, I'm just super... Like, the details are amazing. She did a good um, job. But just, like, the quality. Because, like, you pull, we, we were pulling at it and just touching it. And, like, it's all held on so well. So um, it's super cool. And along with this came um, the trap, which is awesome. Um... It's it's so well done. Like it's all there, all the little bits of detail, and like where the where the screws are. There's a little black felt. Um, she just did an amazing job on this. Like mm -hmm. I'm super pumped, mm -hmm. and uh, I I've been displaying it with my my actual proton pack, and it's it's amazing. So um, I think I'm definitely gonna be wearing this uh, out to a comic expo, maybe. Yeah, uh, maybe I'll wear that. Maybe one. you'll and wear that you'll one. Maybe you'll wear the real one. Like it would. That, <laughs> That sounds like an amazing day. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, thank you for getting me this. You're this welcome. is so awesome. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Okay, and my last gift that I got was this beautiful bag, and it's from Spring, 
and I've wanted this for a little while as well. I just was so drawn to the color. It's like a bronzy color and it's kind of like the quilted. Um, it's soft, which is really nice. And it's really, really, really big. I've already put um, stuff into this bag, so I've been using it. But the lining is, I don't know if you can see that properly. Sorry, I'm just looking into the viewfinder to see if I can see it. Um, but the lining is polka dots on the inside and it's super big. It holds so much stuff. So in my bag, I always have tons and tons and tons of stuff. So it's very practical for me, and I love it. It's so beautiful. It's really nice. Yeah, I love it's it. It's really, really nice when, when I picked it up. Yeah. I, was, like, I just thought it would look, it looked great. <clears throat> yeah. Um, so you got me two last gifts. Yeah. Um, so the first one is um, in, the, in the theme of, of tie clips. Um, because uh, I've been wearing tie clips because I've been uh, I've been shooting like a like a TV show, um, and uh, and I'm always on camera with like a tie, and like for a while the tie was flopping around all over the place, and and my mic would be in there, and they'd have to hide it. So I thought let's wear tie clips, uh, but she got me this really nice um, silver one, and it's got like a really nice kind of like a, a matte finish to it, but on the back she wrote a little note for me. It's only for me to see, but uh, it's really nice. And what I like about it is that it's only an inch wide, so it's meant for skinny ties. Because uh, sometimes, like when I was looking at stores for tie clips, they'd have tie clips, but they're the really long ones. So on a skinny tie, you have to wear it lower on the on the tie, which looks weird sometimes. So I like this one because it can go up a little bit higher. Mm -hmm. um, it's meant for a skinny tie, um, and it doesn't have a spring. It's like kind of like a folded metal, kind of like a paper clip would be. So. It's, um, it holds a tie together really well. Yeah, it's cute. I really love it. Mm -hmm. And the last mm -hmm. gift, um, so up in, up in Canada, mm -hmm. uh, our fav my favorite burrito place, my, one of my favorite eateries, is uh, Mucho Burrito. Um, for the longest time, only suburbs in Calgary had them. And we live kind of inner city, so uh, we'd have to, like, whenever we were in a suburb, we'd be like, let's get Mucho Burrito. Well, I'd be like, let's get Mucho yeah. Burrito. It grew on me. I didn't love it, and yeah. now I'm starting to like it more and more. Um, so she ended up getting me um, two Mucho Burrito gift cards, which I will be enjoying um, during lunches when I'm at work. Yeah. So uh, this is really awesome. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> Okay, is that it? Yeah, I think yeah? that's it. Yeah. Okay, well, I hope that you, we hope that you enjoyed this video and you enjoyed seeing what we got from each other for Christmas. Uh, I hope that you also enjoyed meeting Andrew. It was so nice to have him in a video and I'm sure he will be in more of my videos because he's very good on the camera. <laughs> um, aside from that, I hope that you all had an amazing Christmas and a very happy new year. If you don't celebrate Christmas, I hope that you had just an amazing holiday season. And um, yeah, until the next video, I will talk to you later. Bye!